All right, guys. I think it's about Dokkan time. There we go. Okay, let's get this webcam situated here. Get the webcam situated. Okay. Get the music started. Mm 
And just for Ray, get these, um, get the avatars put up. All right. World Tournament, day two, Scream. All right, how many people we got in here? We got five, six people. Not bad, could be worse. Could be better. All right, what do we got here? We got Bringers, Salvador, Scythe, James, FaZe. How y'all doing? Welcome to the stream. Hit the dang like button. Please do hit the like button. I would appreciate it. James, why do I keep doing this to myself? Dokkan is very loud on my phone, so when I open it... Yeah, I feel... I do that... I still do that to this day. I still do that to this day. I scare myself quite a bit, James. Don't feel bad. James has been a member of the Tea Time Enthusiasts for two months. In the words of Broly, Kakarot! Um, you are now classified as a Super Spud. You are a Super Spud. You are not just a Tea Time Enthusiast. You are a Super Spud. Thank you, dude. Appreciate your support. FaZe is alive. I'm glad you're alive, dude. Bringer is alive. Hey, David. David. How you doing, dude? Emotes. Gotta love all the emotes. Started today. I'm 666. Okay. I, I was about to say, I'm assuming some people are uh, celebrating the fact that today is 420. I, uh, I do not participate in that uh, chain of things that to be done on 420. Although if I did, I probably would be a little bit more relaxed and probably have less health issues. But that's neither here nor there. So unfortunately, I haven't had much time to really do too much grinding. I'm still only at like 25 wins. I'm definitely not going to hit the top um, thing in my bracket, unfortunately. Very unfortunate, but it is what it is. Um, there we go. Now we're all set up. There we go. Now we're... Nope. Why does it do that? Okay. Okay. You are partaking. Well, I hope you uh, you enjoy yourself there, Scythe. Please do enjoy yourself. Responsibly, of course. You know. Chill when you can. Um, Let's see here. Wish you all the best as this is where I depart. All right, FaZe. Appreciate you for stopping by, man. I hope you have a good day and a good night, my man. Appreciate you. Jay Fish. Welcome to the stream. How you doing? Got screwed in my local bracket. I got top four at best. Eh, that's all right. It is what it is. There'll be plenty of chances to get peed off. Um, I mean, that's pretty much the only main reason to really grind excessively. Um, is, you know, you want to get the, the world tournament local rewards. And peel off just isn't really worth the, the pressure, really. It's really not. Uh, so, you know, it, it is what it is. Always responsible. You feel sorry? <laughs> yeah, I bring her. I feel bad for people in your bracket as well. Shoot, you're you're probably stupidly high up there. I haven't. I didn't even bother to check. And all, I'll give an honesty. So, um, little FYI, if people um enjoyed the opening, starting soon, um, music that was playing, that was a song that was done by the Saiyan Enigma. Um, he's a very much older artist that makes music around the type of Bruce Falconer esque type of music um the saiyan enigma yeah he's the one that made that that is a ultra instinct broly theme that he made up obviously it takes a lot of inspiration from faulkner music which is fine it is what it is um i enjoy that soundtrack personally i always enjoy his music so if you want to go take a look at that i have his profile and video linked in the description of the stream no, I am not getting anything out of that. Uh, his video He allows people to play his music, so that's all that that is. I enjoy his music. I don't get compensated or anything like that. I don't have a collab with him or anything of the form. I just want to show off his music. I like his music a lot. We'll catch up on my World Tournament Mission Grind later on tonight. Currently heading home and going to duel with a couple TCG players in the next hour. That sounds fun, dude. Duel? You playing some Yu-Gi-Oh, bro? I've been watching Yu-Gi-Oh lately. Mostly because of Celtic Link. Celtic Link got on my butt for the, like, I don't even know how long. But um, he constantly gets on my butt about watching Yu-Gi-Oh 5Ds. And I've finally gotten to, like, the, like, 
I want to say ending ish almost of 5ds. So I've been in a I've been a Yu-Gi-Oh mood for like the last like month almost now. Bringer is in the top 50. Dang, bro is grinding for real. Rip my peel off dupe. Eh, it is what it is. You can wait. We'll probably get another world tournament next month. In all honesty, Salvador. So, you know, you'll get your second dupe then. Just sub to the homie Enigma. There you go, man. Yeah, Enigma's got some great music. I used to listen to his stuff all the time. Um, I used to also have a intro and outro that would, or I think it was just the outro. Yeah, I only had the outro um, for my videos that had his music as well. So. Just sub to the homie. My day could be better if, if the card shop I went to had gotten the shipment of booster sets today, but they didn't. That's unfortunate. Yeah, but that's cool, dude. That's cool. Unfortunately, I don't play Yu-Gi-Oh anymore. I I'm an old dude. I uh, I stopped playing literally right before the kind of synchro uh, stuff came out. So I, I have no idea how to actually play good or I don't know what is good. I just enjoy the anime. I enjoy the card game, you know, Dark Magician Girl, etc. <laughs> uh, Bringer, let me pass you, bro. Yeah, he ain't gonna let you do that. <laughs> Bringer's not gonna let you pass, Salvador. He shall not let this pass. <laughs> Enigma just got subbed. Falconer esque is my jam. Good to hear, man. Good to hear. I know the whole Falconer OST thing is like a very sensitive topic a lot of the time in the Dragon Ball community. But it is my preferred. You can call it nostalgia all you want. I mean, it's just my vibe of music. I mean, that's just it's just what I grew up on. It's what I enjoy. It doesn't mean I don't enjoy the like the other soundtracks of Dragon Ball. It's just my preference. Remember everybody, music is a form of art. Therefore, it is um what is the wording I'm looking for here? It is subjective. It is not, it, it's opinion based. There is no right or wrong when it comes to music. It's just whatever you vibe to. At least that's my opinion. <laughs> I feel that a little bit. Uh, um. Bringer is Gandalf and everyone else. The Balrog, we shall not pass. <laughs> you shall not pass. This particular booster set is going to be available in stores US on Friday, but the sneak peek release ended up being canceled since the card shop I went to didn't get their shipment. That's unfortunate, man. I think I've had a couple of instances of that happening um, in my time of playing card games with Magic even. It, it's unfortunate when it happens, but it is what it is. You'll get it eventually. Check where I am, Joe. Bring. I will. I will check it um, once I finish this right here. I'll go check it right after this. Music is fire me because I'm a uh, rave from the '90s. Well, no, you're good, Scythe. You're good. Uh, that was that was pretty much a whole. Um, that was my whole click. At least those, that's the people I surrounded myself with anyways at that point of time. Um, so I feel you there, man. I feel you there. Although I, ne I never went to, like, raves or anything like that. That just wasn't my scene. Obviously not. I don't, don't drink or do drugs or do anything like that. And a lot of them, at least the people I were around, they were doing a lot of heavy kind of drugs. And I didn't feel like going out and doing that. I just hung out with them during school and just kept my kept my distance a little bit. Not to say that every raver does that. It's just it was just a common thing back then. We all agree Lincoln Park uh, had banger music. Yes, Lincoln Park is like honestly, I'm honestly surprised I don't have a Lincoln Park tattoo on myself right now. I really am surprised. I have a Slipknot tattoo, but I don't have a I don't have a Lincoln Park tattoo. I should have a Lincoln Park tattoo. I really should. Till the till the day I die, man. Plus, there's no telling when I'll start getting ready to move soon, so that's more cause for stress. Yeah, you and that moving thing, man. It sounds like it's, like, always teetering on that. S moving is always stressful. What is with this boy? 
配信したいいですかブレイキング・ベンジャミンは自分の好きなブランドです。ないことはないです。私は聞いたことがあります。私は聞いたことがあります。私は聞いたことがあります。私は聞いたことがあります。私は聞いたことがあります。But I could, I think that was just either just a rumor. I haven't heard anything like super new from them in a hot minute. Uh, like System of Down. I like System of Down. System of Down's great. System of Down's fantastic. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm all about new metal. I like new metal. You can call me a baby all you want. I, I like all forms of metal. I mean, I'll go into any territory there. But、um, new metal is what I grew up on, obviously. That was my intro to metal.、Uh, let's see here. I'm way down on the bottom. Let's scroll all the way up here.、Uh, da, 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 da. Baba Yaga at 13, the dude. A Reza Besu. I, I think that is a Hitomi. I, I don't, I'm trying to remember who, who that was specifically. I have the number one on my friends list. That's cool. <laughs> I have the number one on my friends list. That's awesome. Um, let's see here. DBC AVS is at 32. 18 Simp is 49. I want to say 18 Simp is supposed to be Rado Kun, but、um, my, I have a feeling that's actually Bringer. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's Bringer.、Um, but my first thought process when I, when I think of Android 18 is like, okay, that's Rado. <laughs> that's that's Rado Simpin. <laughs> Um, Russia is all, all pretty close in there at 79. Oscuro, 222. Salvador, 258. Holy crap, dude. 128 wins. I'm not even going to get any close to that. Toxic Jordan over there at 344. Anto at 409. Yeah, it, Kato yeah, it was Katomi. That's what I thought. It was Katomi. Tomi's number one. Hopefully she can hold it. She let it go on the last day, last world tournament. We'll see what happens. Dark Link at 545. Yeah, I know, I know which one is wrong. I'm just, I was just saying, like, in general, when I, I read the 18 Simp thing, I was just like, okay, I feel like that should be Rado when I read it. Like, that's the first person that came to mind when I read that. Happy 420 World Tournament. <laughs> is that you, Scythe? <laughs> uh. Yeah, there's Rado. Rado's、uh, at 72 wins. Wow, Rado's going, man. Holy crap. Kudos to you, Rado. Dang. Rado going. He's at 72 wins. That's crazy. Scythe, I'm happy. That's good. Always strive to be happy. You're not a failure, Salvador. I don't know why you think that. You're crazy. Salvador's doing great. David, David, you're at 38 wins. That's a good amount, man. That's good. Love to see it. Love to see it. You're ahead of me. <laughs> Archie over here at 30. Oh, he got his 30 and he bounced, probably. Genix, 30. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. All right, let's stop playing catch up. That's,、uh, <laughs> that's what I thought, Sai. That's what I thought. I knew it was you, man. I knew it was you. I knew it was you, my dude. But yeah, in all honesty, like, back to the music thing. I would 110%, I'd be playing nothing but metal. If I had the choice, if I didn't have to worry about a freaking copyright strike and, you know, a monetization, like,、uh, being turned off, I would 100% just play metal.、I'd、just play metal all the time. That and probably anime music. <laughs> probably anime music for sure. Keep on the grind while you can, Blazer. You know, take it, take it as it goes. Now that we don't have Jackie Chun as a part of the World Tournament rewards, I cannot stress enough that World Tournament isn't that much of a big, like, you need to grind. You know, get your 30 wins, you can bounce after that.、Um, the rewards just aren't there. I mean, the rewards are good. Obviously, getting a high enough reward is fantastic, and that's why you do it. That and you know, the、uh, you know, the, the street cred, but overall, you know, it's not really, it's never worth the grind for world tournament if you're just gonna grind to grind. The local rewards are far less enticing right now. I like Pilaf, I love Pilaf, I think he's got great animations, he's a fun unit, 
but by no means is he worth grinding hardcore on local, you know? Ooh, children of Bodom. Deadly sinners? Trivium. Old school. Guns and Roses. Nice. Air metal. Love it. I'm going to get an auto clicker for World Tournament. Less than my sanity. I would not do that. You will lose your account instantaneously, Salvador. Don't do it, man. Don't do it. You will lose your account so fast you couldn't even blink. You wouldn't even be able to blink. Kind of div digging uh, Polyphia. Nice. When I get upset over pretty much anything concerning take a watch here. Yeah. No, I, I get that. Depression sucks balls, man. The only reason I can, like, combat my own depression is because of you guys. That and Benji. I just look at Benji for, like, five seconds, and he, he just looks so cute that I, I just get a little bit better. But everyone's got to find their own way to get out of depression. It's different for everyone. It can never be the same. It might be somewhat similar, but it's never the same. Everyone's got their own thing. I wish you the best, dude. Uh... I don't care about P-Love, I just want to be on the number one spot. He wants that street cred. Bringer wants that street cred, that's all that matters. Which is fair, street cred is, uh, street cred is what matters. I'm not gonna lie, like, a couple times I wish I, I, like, went harder on World Tournament just for the title. Just so I could have an impressive title to throw up on my profile. How are you? What are you doing? What is Uku? When I'm done with my burritos, I'm putting you in front of the camera, Foof. That'd be dangerous. If you haven't heard Ari now at that point. There's this guy on YouTube whose channel is called Anime Guitar Lessons. He does anime OSTs with his guitar. Pretty awesome. It sounds awesome. Yeah, it sounds fantastic. I think I've seen him. Have I linked? I swear I've 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 uh, I've linked a couple of his videos. I might have. I've probably come across him several times. There's a couple of them that do do those. I might try to get on a world tournament at some points, but can't really be doing that anytime soon. It is what it is, Dark Link. How you doing, by the way, man? Welcome to the stream. How are you? How is your, how is the grind of life going? I'm really curious when Ray is going to come in here with his Ari face. Ray will be in here eventually. He's got, he's got to cure his, um, his gambling addiction in some form of the matter, you know? He's got to. Um, no, oh, never mind. I'll take it. I'll put it back. I'll put it back. I'll just put it back. I swear you put the boy up upstairs for a second. I didn't even realize he was there. Gotcha. Ari. Her name is pronounced, uh, Ari, but, you know. But you, I, I mean, it could be like that. It could be like this. Um, it's specifically ah. Oh. <laughs> Doing good. Need to try and get 150-ish wins so I can forget about world tournament. Study for my exams. I mean. At the end of the day, those exams are worth it more than World Tournament, but I feel ya. You're doing pretty well, though, Dark Link. Shoot, yeah. You're doing pretty well. Rip most of my friends list after tomorrow. I'm using Ari now. <laughs> this poor fluff. 
I just make fun of her name so much. Assuming I can go to one of the local card shops next weekend, I'll be lucky to get some of the cards I want out of that set. You don't order any of them online, dude? I used to order a bunch of magic cards online all the time. Card shop, going to card shops and, and hunting for a card is cool, but for the most part, it's just, it's so stressful because usually the prices are super hiked up. Um, and it's just like, it's not feasible half the time to get the cards you need. It's fun, but it's just not feasible half the time. At least around here in Washington, in the Seattle area, it's a fight. It's a fight to get uh, trading cards. It really is. Most of your friends are about to stop playing Dokkan after Chain Battle, huh? Wow. That's uh, not what I expected to hear. I mean, uh, Chain Battle's cool. I like Chain Battle. I don't think it's worth quitting the game over, but... Especially since they haven't introduced uh, the replacement just yet. Like, I would probably wait until after the replacement um, pops up. And then decide if it's worth uh, saying screw it and bailing on. You know? Because they, they can't just screw the players like that. You know, they know for a fact people have pumped resources into duplicate units. And I just feel like they need to find a mode that will benefit all of those duplicated units that they wasted all of their uh, uh, resources on. So, I feel like there's got to be some new game mode that'll come around Worldwide Download, or even Golden Week soon, right now. Um, even Tanabata, perhaps. Anytime between now and in September, I just feel it, you know? Feels weird that people leave because of Chain Battle. I mean, yeah, but it's more of like a slap to the face to them because they wasted all those resources. So I understand why people would want to quit after that. I do. I get it. It's it's because uh, Kats Katsuki basically would have just insulted everybody and slapped them. Like, hey, you just wasted all your resources. Bye. Peace. So I get it. I get it. It's a rage quit, but still. I still do, but I won't order stuff online uh, again until after I move. Fair enough. Yeah, you don't want to be ordering stuff if you're about to move. It just gets annoying with the um, with the uh, address changing and so forth. So I get that. That's fair. That's fair. I, I, I That slipped my mind. We betting on tonight's boxing match. I do not follow boxing. I'm sorry, dude. But I don't know. I hope you win your bet. <laughs> I hope you win your bet. I just... Uh, I don't follow boxing, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, Salvador. High as a kite, Bringer. That's how high I think. High as a kite. Uh, Probably 20. I'm going to say once you hit 25 or 20, you're going to hit a wall. That's, that's what I feel, Bringer. I feel like you'll hit a wall around the 20 margin. And then it'll just be purely like... It'll just be like pure uh, willpower if you can get past the 20 point. Pure willpower. For consecutive wins? No, I mean he means placement. He means placement. I'm pretty sure Bringer's in top fifty right now. I'm pretty sure he's top fifty. So Yeah, I can double check, but I think he's like top fifty right now. I'm probably gonna go check and he's on like forty nine or something.
Um. Yeah, he's 49 right now. This one's Bringer right here. Bringer is the 18 simp. So. He's on 49th right now. Which is only about nine wins from 32. So, I mean, if he really hardcore goes at it, he could easily hit the 30s. But yeah, once it, I think it's the, it's definitely around the 20s margin that I feel like he will just struggle with. Yeah, top 20 is currently at 330 wins. Yeah, I, I just really think that around the 20 range is when he's gonna get he's gonna hit a wall, for real. Yeah. I was gonna say Dark Link was the local really uh, baiting you because the lo those locals, man, locals get serious. Like local is almost more important than even getting on a top rank, actual top ranking. Like nobody cares about what your actual placement determinant is. What is your local? <laughs> if you get local one, that's crazy. That's crazy. Hey, Lightspeed, how you doing, man? Yeah, top 50 is probably realistic. He'll probably stay in the 40, 30 range at m most. 50 if he wants to just be comfortable. Local placements feel more personal. Exactly. That's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your local ranking is a personal thing. Exhausted Lightspeed? I feel that, dude. I feel you, man. Feel it. Make sure you go get some coffee or tea or relax. I'm not really sure how you want to go about that. It's the weekend. Maybe just relax if you're exhausted, or you can go get some ca caffeine and, you know, get that energy back. Local rank one, my local two gave up after seeing 230 wins. Good! Caffeine is not an option. Okay, that's unfortunate. I'd say sugar, but sugar crashes are brutal. Hello, Mrs. David. I hope that she is doing well. Hello. Oh, okay, wait a minute. I got a question. I got a question. I'm trying to eat and do my thing, but... For if people didn't realize, there's been a leak on uh, what the Golden Week celebration could potentially be. And apparently, it could be uh, Majin Buu Saga. It could be Majin Buu Saga. And it could even be a new Super Saiyan 3 unit. A new Super Saiyan 3 Goku, specifically. I've seen a lot of mixed behavior on that. What do people think about getting another Super Saiyan 3 Goku specifically? Like, is a Super Saiyan 3 Goku for Golden Week a good or a bad thing, in your opinion?
Uh, she's in the hospital since Tuesday because of the therapy complications. She's doing a lot better. Should be coming home on Monday. Ah, sounds good. It sounds like it, I mean, it started off bad, but it's going good. It's going good. Positivity, David. Positivity. I'm glad to hear it. Um, could be 2024, but the year of Super Saiyan 3. Uh, yeah, I, that's the way I'm looking at it there, Dark Link. Uh, 2024 could be the year of Super Saiyan 3, which I'm fine with. I'm perfectly fine with. Uh, because if that's the case, that means that heroes, we might finally get Super Saiyan 3 Vachito. Oh my god, I've been waiting for that for years. Been wanting a Super Saiyan 3 Gogeta or Vachito from Heroes for so long in Dokkan. I just feel like they've dodged it so much that they just can't dodge it if there's a whole year of just pure Super Saiyan 3 content. Super Saiyan 3 Goku is a little iffy so soon. Okay, look at it this way, Lightspeed. What if the Goku is an angel Super Saiyan 3 Goku? Hmm? What if it's an angel Super Saiyan 3 Goku? Then that would mean that he could freely link with the STR Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Huh? You know, just literally making the Golden Week one an angel version makes it completely fine, in my opinion. Like, you can't even argue about it anymore as long as it's an angel Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Because as of right now, I don't even think there's any Angel Super Saiyan 3 Gokus that they could chuck into the game. Other than the Super Easy A for the tech one, perhaps? Like, that's the only thing that could I, I really could see that could conflict with it. But that's not that's a long ways off that I don't feel like we'll get. So... She is definitely a fighter, David. David, she is definitely a fighter. From the whole time that I've I've known I've known you, hundred percent, hundred percent. What's up, Adam? How you doing, dude? Welcome to the stream. Part two, LR Kid Boo. Man, if they have a freaking, <laughs> if they have another Majin Boo saga themed. Freaking celebration. And there's no LR Kid Boo. Oh, God. Everybody's going to lose their marbles. <laughs> People are going to lose their marbles. Oh, that free-to-play tech one is long overdue for either another Awakening or an Easy A. It's long overdue. That was like one of the first units to grind up in the game, and I'm surprised they haven't touched it since. Very weird. I really hope part two won't be LR Kid Boo. I don't think I'll be able to skip him. I I get that. Just remember, I, I think the part two would come back during Worldwide Download Celebration. I think he would be featured on another banner. That's the, th that's the thing about Golden Week. is Golden Week is hype every year. Golden Week is always super hype. But the fact remains is that, like, pretty much everything from that celebration carries over to Worldwide Download Celebration. So, I mean, Golden Week is basically part of Worldwide Download Celebration. It's just really, it's it's really, really hard to skip it. But at least you know that if you don't get it during Golden Week, you do have um, Worldwide Download Celebration around the corner to uh, remedy that. You're in sweat territory, Bringer? Oh boy. That means you can't breathe. That Tech Goku was one of the first ones I grinded to get a rainbow copy for every single stage. Yeah, I feel that. I feel that. You know what they say about karma? Karma?
I'm just gonna go through the win 20 world tournament. Gotcha. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. I would go for 30, but yeah, I can understand why you'd only go for the 20. 20 is fine. It gets you all the base rewards. I think 30 would get you all the Kai's. I think it's I think it's 20 to 30 is Kai's. Depending on your score, of course. See how you feel at 20. Fair enough. Fair enough. I think I'm going to change the music real quick. Hold up. I am almost done with my burrito. And then I'm going to grab the floof and put her on camera. All right, Blazer. Hope you have a good day and a good night, man. Take it easy. It felt great at 20, now not so much. It's like not enough for some people once they hit 20. I get it. Once you hit 20, you feel like you should just keep going sometimes. This world tournament, man, it's just such a... It just really kicks it out of you. Um, Got to 120 mil in chain battle by pure chance. Pure RNG. I mean, make sure you get all the rewards, of course. Probably want to try and get as much of the currency as possible. I gotta check and see how many uh, how many chests I can get with the chain battle currency right now. I gotta check and see. I haven't checked that in a minute. Stuck at 2%. I'm sorry to hear that, man. I mean, it's not a big deal. 2% isn't end-all, be-all. I think the only thing that's different between 2 and 1 is what, like... A single dragon stone? Like, I think that's it. I think that's the only difference between 2 and 1%. I think you get a dragon stone and what? An extra sticker? I think it's an extra sticker, perhaps. I really don't remember what the difference is between 1 and 2% too much. Your screen blacked out? What does that even mean? What does it even mean your screen blacked out? You get five more of the big currency? Yeah, I, I don't I don't know what else. I'm sure if Rado was here, he could tell me.
Ooh. All right. I think I'm stuffed now. Um, well, I would first start by trying to reset your game. That's a little weird, Sal. One sticker, three Kai's, one Diamond Hercule, and that's it. I mean, the extra sticker isn't that big of a deal. I don't think the extra sticker is that big of a deal. The sticker is like... I don't know. In recent time, a lot of the units with sticker effects have been pretty poor. Like, let's be real here. How many times have you applied a sticker onto a unit and been disappointed by it? Like, there's been so many times that some of the sticker effects are just so lackluster. Like, bleh. Like, don't get me wrong. Piccolo's is fantastic. Piccolo has a fantastic sticker. You know, because he has an actual aura. Um, but, I mean, look at this STR Piccolo right here. Like, you can hardly tell there's a sticker effect right here. What, you see it barely, like, flashing on the lightning bolts? It just looks so poor. Like, this doesn't look like a good sticker effect. I could have went without even applying a sticker to this unit, because I wouldn't have known the difference. I wouldn't have noticed the difference. Like, it's just like, okay. <laughs> so what? <laughs> Disappointed by fi uh, stickers 50% of the time? Yeah, that sounds about right. More than I can count. Yeah, if you put I I put a sticker on like favorite units now. Favorite or ones that I deem are like, you know, you you get a reward thing. You just encountered two bonus chance enemies in the prelims? I don't think I've ever seen that. I spent 120k and got nothing from from it. Darn, dude. I'm sorry. Uh I think I put stickers on the gammas and that's about it. I mean, I don't remember what the Gamma's ones look like. I want to say... I want to say Gamma 2's looks good. I don't know about Gamma 1. We back... Okay, that's good. It's good to hear, Salvador. That's that's good, man. I mean, I don't know how hot your phone is getting, but um, you might want to give World Tournament a rest if your phone is starting to overheat. Uh, you can get all three enemies to be bonus chance light. I've only ever gotten that twice. Wow. I did not know that. That is news to me. Totally crazy to me, Dark Link. Lightspeed. Uh, yeah. I mean, that that stuff's crazy. That's crazy. I've never seen more than one on prelims. Never have I seen more than that. That's crazy. Okay, foofies. You had to be scooped. I had to scoop you. I had to scoop this foof. I had to scoop her. This foofy. Be mad. Probably mad now. He is fluffy, baby. <laughs> she is so mad at me. She is so mad. She's like, this is dumb. You check the Dokkan wiki on uh, to see if you'll actually grab for the unit. Yeah, that makes sense. I would definitely do that. I would definitely do that. Definitely check it.
Ari is on the camera. Yep. Ari, you gotta make me money. She's a stinking freeloader. She doesn't pitch in at all. You gotta make us money, Floof. You gotta make me rich. I can't do it. Ari could be rich. Her cuteness would get me to be rich. May I have more gold? You just spent 28k and got nothing? Dang. The floof. He is displeased. Okay. I'll stop torturing her. Okay, now Tail is in the way, huh? Tail is in the way, huh? Okay, I see how it is. This is her revenge. She gets the tail in the way whenever she's mad. She's like, yep, tail in the way. Uh, there's a few units that really look great with stickers. Tech Super Saiyan 3 Broly looks awesome. Intelligence Metal Cooler, Kid Boo, STR Omega. There's a quite a few good units with uh, stickers. And I feel like a lot of older units look better with stickers. Like, I feel like the older the unit gets, the better they kind of look. I don't know why. I think they just started changing up the way some of the artworks looked. So it changed how the uh, stickers would look, too. I think that's how that kind of went. Yeah, let me look real quick here. Let's look at let's try to look at some sticker effects. Let's let's go to acquired URLR. It's here. Like this looks pretty awesome. Like this looks kind of cool. I love this sticker effect. Like why does it why don't most of the units have a sticker effect like this? Like why not? You know? Like why don't we why don't we have this? That there's no sticker effect there. I didn't use the sticker effect on that one or that one or that one or that one or that one. Okay, hold on a sec. Hold on a sec here. Um, special sticker, there we go. Wait, why is there a filter option? I just realized that. Why is there a filter option? What other special... Sp what? Are we supposed to get other types of, like, stickers here? What? Okay confusing all right let's see here um i gave him a, i mean that's pretty cool i kind of like this sticker effect this sticker effect looks kind of good uh it doesn't look it doesn't look crazy but it still looks good you know like it actually looks like it's doing something or the sticker that only worked for any blue Goku. Oh, okay, gotcha. It was just to differentiate different types of stickers. Am I gunning for 100 wins? Probably not, no. Probably will not do that. I'll probably settle wherever I settle. Um, 30 and above. I'm pretty sure my locals got probably lapped by now. Like, this sticker looks pretty dope, actually, too. You know, like, most of the units don't get stickers like this at all. Like, you hardly ever get a sticker like this. I don't even know how they did this sticker. It looks so crazy to me. I don't even know how they did this. Let's go look at more recent ones. Like, there's hardly a sticker effect here. You can barely see the sticker effect going like it does look it looks okay it looks okay but it, it you could just barely see it i can see it a little bit it looks pretty nice it looks nice but it doesn't look crazy you know i think it still looks good oh i didn't even put a sticker on vegeta probably because i don't want to i think once you know maybe when he transform you know what? i'm gonna just go ahead and throw it on there let's let's see what happens here let's see what happens when we place the sticker on vegeta here yeah, see that like that's just not impressive to me. 
these random like little lines up here like why do i care about those why do i care about those like give me more to look at like even this doesn't look that great he does have an aura he has an aura but they didn't even really make it glow like why doesn't this Vegeta's aura have a glow it just doesn't make sense to me you know it, it just doesn't make any sense because uh, hold on a sec here what about the super saiyan form here Oh, that looks terrible, too. I mean, it looks like something. I mean, they threw something together there. <laughs> like, what? Now, Rose's looks pretty decent. I think Rose looks okay. I, it's just because they're making the, the sword look really highlighted, and I, I like it. I think it looks all right. I think it looks okay. It could be better, but I think it still looks pretty decent. What about when he goes into his clone? Oh, when he goes into the clone, that's pretty cool, actually. I like that. Yeah, no, that looks pretty nice. I think it's okay. Once again, could be possibly a little better, but... Um... The Intelligence Metal Cooler. The T-U-R, huh? Okay, let me go see. I'm assuming you're not talking about this one. I assume you're talking about... This one. Oh, he looks like he could have a really good sticker. I'll go ahead and apply it. I have 40. I have 40 stickers, man. I have 40 stickers. I have so many stickers. I have so many stickers. Yo, yeah. No, that looks great. That looks pretty good. Not gonna lie. Yeah, that looks really good. What the freak, man? Like, why do all these older units have better freaking sticker effects? It's not okay. Like, Foo's looks okay. It looks decent, but... Uh, what about uh, what about this Goku Black? This Goku Black's not too bad. What does he look like when he transforms? See, when he transforms right here, this looks fantastic. This looks amazing. The diamond background ruins the cards, though. Y'all can call me old, but I like the diamond background from time to time. Some of them I do feel like the diamond background looks like crap. I do I do get it. But in all honesty, I kinda like the diamond background if I'm not if I'm gonna be honest. I, I kinda like it. It's because it it's like it's like a card. You know, if you actually collected like older style of cards back in the day in like the nineties era, like you always had that diamond card effect or a, a similar one. And it was just so cool to have that in your hands, you know? But, you know, if I had this as, like, an actual card art, like, an actual card, th th I think it would be st I think it would be fantastic. But it's not, you know? The Intelligence Janemba one is good. STR Omega and Intelligence Kid Buu. What about Kid Buu? Hold on a sec. Where's Kid Buu? Do I even have a sticker on him? I don't have a sticker on it. This dude's going to get a super easy A, and he's going to be broken. When this guy came out, he was busted. When this freaking Kid Buu came out, he was busted. This was a busted unit back in the day. When he gets his super easy A, if he's not as busted as he was on release, I'm going to be mad. I'm going to be mad if he's not as busted as he was on release. I, I like uh, This Kid Buu was crazy. This Kid Buu was crazy back then. I'll never get used to the new layout for quest mode. Yeah, I feel that, Bringer. I feel that. Uh, where's Intelligence Janemba? Oh, yeah. Intelligence Janemba looks pretty sick, too. That green, dude. That green. I don't think I've ever seen that on another card. Like, does Is there any other card that has a similar type of effect like that? I don't think there is. That's pretty crazy. Yeah, like, they don't even make... They don't even, like, stick these kind of effects on units anymore. Like, they really don't. Like, they really don't. Um... Who was the other one? STR Omega, right? We're talking about STR Omega. I don't even think I have a sticker on him. No, I don't. He will also get an easy, a uh, super easy A at some point. So yeah, sure, I'll give him a sticker. He'll get a super easy A. He'll get one. Whoa! Yo! Dokkan's holding out on us, man. 
the those freaking card developers are freaking holding out on us giving having all these older units have these amazing freaking sticker effects but then they just like don't even try on new units like there is no new unit that looks like this <laughs> like what the fun people saying str gogeta will be better than intelligence janemba one day super easy eh? Uh, it's hard to say. They have a bare bones. Well, it's not bare bones, but it really just depends on what they add, you know? You you know you don't know what they're going to add. You just don't know. Tech Super Saiyan Broccoli. 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 Where is my tech? There he is. He already has a sticker. Yeah. Super Saiyan 3. I, I think I tried to give all the Super Saiyan 3s their stickers, so... Yeah, he looks really good. He looks really good. I like it. I like it a lot. Yeah, man. Like, they, they just don't do stickers the same anymore. Yeah, like, what is this? What is this? This is just boring. Like, what, what is... What is... What is with that? See, I don't even want to give a sticker to this, because I know it's just going to make all of these random flames glow, and that's it. Like, that's all that it's going to do. I don't even want to bother with it. The second form right here looks okay, probably. You can see the purple aura will probably glow. This probably part of the sticker would probably look really good. Probably. There is a high chance that this, uh, that this unit will get an easy A, finally. There's a high chance that we could get this with a, with an easy A come, uh, Golden Week. If it's full Majin Buu, if it's like a full Majin Buu saga thing, it's very possible that, that this unit could get an easy A. It's very possible. Very possible, for sure. Wait, doesn't he eat cooler? Uh, it looks okay. What about you? I mean, even his looks okay. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. We're, we're going way off topic here. We're going way off topic here. Let's just get back to it. Let's get back to the world tournament. Come on. Come on. Oh, did I... Oh, I guess... Oh, we started before login. That's probably why. 2,743 days logged in. I'm going to have to wait till like, January or February in order to hit 3,000. Ugh. Okay. Um... Even at launch. Tech, I mean, he, he was okay on launch. He wasn't crazy. I would say uh, that tech boo, you could have skipped. You could have skipped that tech boo, and it wouldn't have been a big deal back then. That's what that's what I'm trying. I That's what I feel like I remember it feeling like. Three thousand day login bonus is so bad. No, nah, I li I like the three thousand day login bonus. I don't think it's bad. I like it. I don't think it's a big deal. Why don't you like the three thousand login day bonus? You just not like the memory? I like it. I think it's okay. Uh, Sandland wallpaper looks good. Yeah, Sandland wall. Sandland, man. I'm so excited for Sandland. I'll be real. I wanted to really like lock down and make like. A whole slew of content for Sandland. I really wanted to. I just don't... I just haven't been given the opportunity of time. I really wanted to. There's a whole bunch of stuff to Sandland. There really is. What? That's true. Mrs. Saiyan just said that Benji eats time. He is a time eater. I would love to do a week of Sandland. I don't think my audience would be okay with it, though. I do not think they would be overjoyed by that. I do want to do it. My my only thought process is I don't know if I would put Sandland into this 
YouTube account or if I would put it into the gaming one. Because technically, um, I mean, Sandland is made by uh, Kira Toriyama, so it's not in the Dragon Ball universe, but um, it's made by the same author, obviously. So... Uh, but I don't know if I would classify that as Dragon Ball content. Because that's what I wanted to keep on uh, with this account. Was I wanted to just keep it as all um, specifically Dragon Ball. Uh, but I don't I don't know if I would classify Sandland as Dragon Ball area. I feel like I should just because it's Kira Toriyama. But at the same time, I don't know. I think that's the only thing that's... That's the real thing that stopped me from making it. Is like, I don't know how I would go about that because if you don't know about youtube and it's freaking algorithm bullcrap it's like as soon as you start trying to diversify yourself unless you're already established um you going off into left field with a different category or something and it they youtube hurts you i think sandland would be interesting there's a lot of dragon ball nodes in it that i i'd love to point out Heck, <laughs> I mean, it's basically Deborah, yeah. It looks like Dragon Ball. It's the same art style as Dragon Ball, but that's just the Kira Toriyama style. Maybe I could, like, name it a folder like Toriyama's Legacy. Sandland. Kira Toriyama Legacy. Sandland's been out forever, too. Like, Sandland's been out for so long. It's such an old freaking manga. It's surprising that it never got the attention that it deserves. I'm really sad that it didn't get the attention it deserved. Up until now, of course. Now it's starting to get a whole bunch of stuff, which is fantastic to see. That's pretty bad, Bringer, that the new layout makes you not want a Link level. That's pretty bad, not gonna lie. I don't think you should be having a dog chase a cat. Ari, why are you over there in that corner? What are you doing? What do you hear? I think Toriyama was a big thing in a large majority of people's childhoods without them even noticing. He really was. It was really crazy, all the things that he made. Probably saw things as a kid that you didn't realize was even Toriyama. They play together, so it's all right, I hope. You hope. He said he hopes. Got that hope. Got that hope. All right, I'm only at 30 freaking wins. <laughs> well, there's all the rewards. Let's go check all the rankings and whatnot real quick. Obviously, I'm in no rush because it, it won't matter. Yeah, I got all the missions, so that's good. Let's go with the rankings. Let's look at the friends. All right, uh, Baba Yaga still at thirteen. Uh, Bringer has not moved; he's still at that forty-nine spot. Salvador still at two fifty-three. 
Dark Link at 540. Scythe at 628. <clears throat> Rado at 1052. David at 3398. Okay. Let's look at my local bracket. I am in ninth place, and the number one on my bracket is only at 62 wins. That is it. He is fighting with those other top three, though. He's fighting with them. 59, 32, what? Oh, longest win streak. My dude lost a streak. That's unfortunate. Yeah, top four is definitely uh, holding its pace, that's for sure. They're holding their pace around the 60. I imagine eh, if they're still going that much, I don't think they'll stop. I don't think I could catch up to them. They're double my wins. They're double. Though I will say I was already in, like, the 10s to almost 20 when I first checked this guy, and he was at 30 before, so I could probably catch up if I tried. Hmm? Who lost their streak? Uh, nobody, just some local. I was just looking at their win streaks, that's all. This poor boy. Boy. Yeah, my local's not too bad. It's, it's just unfortunate I haven't been uh, really pushing it, so... You lost your streak, Salvador. Oh, no. Some of it I recognized immediately, like playing uh, Chrono Trigger. Man, I love Chrono Trigger, man. Why does Chrono look like a Saiyan? <laughs> That's funny. Uh, yeah, Chrono Trigger. I love Chrono Trigger. Chrono Trigger is a great game. If you haven't played it, you should try it. 235 win streak. Nice. Micah, how's it going, dude? Welcome to the stream. How you doing? What's up? How goes the grind? I honestly don't need to keep grinding. I just, I'm just, I don't know, giving it the time. Because I'm not going to hit the top local. I, I've, I've come to that uh, conclusion that I will not be hitting the top local. Uh, my local number two trying to catch... So, bro gave up. That's probably true. I, I wouldn't blame... I don't blame him, Bringer. <laughs> I mean, if I saw you in my top local number one, I would give up too. Uh, okay. Hold on a sec, guys. I'll be right back.
ไม I'm technically here, but I'm also technically holding a baby, so. Technically holding a baby. Uh, you're doing spectacular. Glad to hear it, Micah, if you're still here. Uh, David David, check this out. Toriyama was born on April 5th, my wife's birthday. And he died on the 1st, which is my birthday. Matrix moment. That's a matrix moment there, my dude. That is a matrix moment if there ever was one. I was 45 million behind my number two local this morning. Now I'm 40 million ahead. He's not a threat. Probably not. Probably not a threat. You need to chill, little dude. You gotta chill. You gotta chill. This boy got to chill. He's super angies. He's super angies. I'll keep the keep the pass fire. He is super angies right now. He is super angies. He wants his food. Mowing down his local competitors. For real. He really is. Are you gonna stay calm? Huh? Are you gonna scream at me again? Huh? Sorry. Baby takes priority. Baby dude, take priority. Baby dude, take priority. He's just chilling right now, waiting for his food. Yeah. 
He's like, I'm hungry. Just a little bit longer. A little bit longer. This is kind of why I wish there was an auto mode for World Tournament. Exactly 195 million ahead of your local rank. Dang. That's a lot of uh, ahead. We love when Benji streams with you. The dude doesn't, uh, he's, uh, he's, uh, I, I love it when he streams with me too. He's just sometimes a little too, uh, angry. He's a little tired, but he wants his food. You gonna be calm? Hmm? You gonna stay calm? Are you gonna go legendary Super Saiyan again? Hmm? What you doing? This little dude. Look at this little guy. Look at this little guy. Good. I'm tired. He's like, stop putting the camera on me. Stop. He's a little guy. He's a little guy. Screamed like a banshee? Oh lordy. Yeah, that's how he's been. Uh, his lungs have been developing more and more. So he's been getting louder and louder. Don't have to worry because my microphone cuts out at a certain decibel. So like if he ever screams, it'll hit the decibel point so quick that it'll just mute the audio. Should almost never hear him scream. Why are you so tired? Why are you so cranky? Hmm? He had a big day. He had, he met people today, so. He met some new family members today. So he's, he's pretty tired. There's a lot of interaction. Yeah. Once again, I really wish there was some form of an auto movement, at least, on World Tournament. Like, auto movement would be nice. He's so tired. I'm like trying to reach for my, my phone right now. It's really difficult. Barely grabbing it. There we go. Uh oh. You doing, dude? You good? You good? Getting angies. He's getting angies.
basically. Gotta be very quiet. We don't want him going crazy. Uh-oh. Spoke too soon. He is awakened! He is awakened! Oh no. He is awakening. He is awakening. Doomed. Doomed. I am doomed. He is awakening. What you doing, dude? Uh, I will be right back real quick. Real quick. I will be right back. Come on. There it goes. little dude or little dude
Okay. He should be okay. He should be okay now. Should be, keyword. <laughs> I'm kind of curious if I should just probably call it on World Tournament and I'll just casually go at it later. I'm not really sure there's much of a point to continue. Baba Yaga, yo, dude, how are you doing? You're on like 15th or 14th or something place, dude. That's crazy. Congrats on your placement. Yeah, Baba Yaga right there. That's the number 14th or 13th? Some, it's somewhere, it's a number in there. It's one of those numbers. He's, like, at the top of my friends list right now. I feel like I have a rather large, like, what? Why is my placement so high? Why is my current ranking 6,000 when I'm only at 30 wins? I feel like that's a really high ranking for like... It's not a super high ranking. Maybe, maybe I'm exaggerating. Huh. Anyways. Trying to get a placement in the top 10 that I don't have yet for the title. Got you, got you. Yeah, I was gonna. I was gonna say, um, what were, where were you here? Say, so, yeah, you're number thirteen at the moment, thirteenth place. Bringer, you're slacking, my dude. You did get usurped again, Bringer. What's up with that, man? There's almost, like, no tech-type enemies in World Tournament. Yeah, I mean, it, it happens. I mean, I, I don't see... It wouldn't matter if there was. It wouldn't matter if they were all physical. It'd still be fine. I'm playing till the end of World Tournament. Like, have you slept? Have you slept, my man? My dude? Yeah, you must be tired. Sitting at 378 wins. Has not lost a single one, by the way. He's, he has got a 378 win streak. Not lost once. Pretty dang good placement. How many would I need? Wow, it wouldn't be that hard for me to get up into the top ranking. It really wouldn't. My locals are so easy right now. People, everyone's got to be mad at me right now because this is like a really easy local and I'm just not trying. <laughs> like I'm really not trying that hard at all, but oh, the local I'm in is just, it's, it's easy pickings and I could just grab it if I really wanted it. I really could. It's almost like I'm wasting it. Taking down more heck enemies would give more points? Oh, I didn't realize that. Next world tournament, you're going for the big number one? Uh, you're gonna you're gonna have to fight Katomi for that one, my man. You're gonna have to fight Katomi. Katomi, ah, she's still going. 571. Good luck to you going for that number one. Good luck. Because dang. Just dang. Going for top 20 next? Gotcha. Discord is your OP. He's your opponent. I 
I've gotten second before, so I think I have a chance. You definitely do have a chance. I believe in you. I believe if you put your, if you put it in there, you put in that effort, I believe you could do it. I 100% believe it. Uh oh. Oh, excuse me. Is he gonna scream? Is he gonna scream? Oh boy. I only got one overall once I played JP years ago. Like, number one overall on a JP account? I imagine you're not talking about local, because, like, dang. Yeah, I never really went that hard for World Tournament back in the day. It was much harder because it was pure stone usage required back in the day. Haven't gotten it since, gotcha. Ah, this is the worst map. I hate it when we get this map. No, you stay away from my bonus! God, I hate this part. I hate this prelim stage. This prelim stage sucks. It shouldn't even be a part of World Tournament. This shouldn't even be a part of the World Tournament prelims. Gotta get that JoJo freaking intro in. It really is so good, not gonna lie. It's definitely a JoJo freaking OST, though. <laughs> it has to be. Uh, you got 70 wins. Dang, dude. Nice. That's awesome. That's a good number, actually, Black Mask. 21 for Golden Week. She okay, so for real talk, I was think I was just thinking about that light speed. And I think it is possible she could return if whoever the, um, whatever the Golden Week, like, extreme unit is. If it's a Majin Buu, I think it's entirely possible we could easily get 21 on the banner. I think it's very possible. I think it's very much possible she could show up, for sure. Which, if so, there goes all my red coins. <laughs> like, there goes all my red coins if that happens. Either that or goes all my stones. It's one of the two. Or both. We got we got to get that rainbow status in, so I need three dupes, and then I got to get an SSR copy, so I got to get four dupes. I got to get four dupes of twenty one right now. The world tournament. I woke up ten hours before it started. Slept in total so far about eight to nine hours. Was able to take a shower, do a few other responses, but still able to keep the top spot. Wow. Maybe you should go into management, Baba Yaga. Is that is that your IRL job? Do you, are you a manager? Because like that's a that's a that's some real good time management right there, my dude. That's some good time management. I gotta say, like holy crap, dude's got that focus. He's just got that focus. He's just built different. <laughs> He's just built different with that kind of management. 
If she'll be on the Golden Week banner, I'm summoning. I, f I feel it. I, I am too. Give me a Dokkan Fest 18, then I'm going bankrupt. You and Rodokun both. Go for the top 30, Bringer. Bringer should go for top 30. Agreed, Baba. I am kind of curious if anyone has uh, easy aid any of the other units. I'm just curious. We need LR Chi Chi. That would be dope. Not gonna lie. Part 2 LR Chi Chi. I'd love that. I'd be down for that. I don't know what team I'd put her on, other than an Earthbred team, but still. Yeah, for easy A World Tournament units, I'm curious if anybody's like choosing to easy a them i did not mean to send a friend request right there because some of these guys are okay some of them aren't i mean oh i still need to awaken bojack i forgot about bojack i need to awaken him So, like, this Goku right here, like, you could easy A him. Um, who else could you easy A? Who was the other unit? Was it, it was that physical Goku, that's right. It was that physical Goku. I think he should be classified as Saiyan Saga. Or not Saiyan Saga, but... Oh, he's not part of Dragon Ball Saga. That's interesting. Isn't he the foot Goku? Yeah, he should be able to awaken. He just got it, right? Oh, that's right, that's right. Because he's an adult, he's not classified as Dragon Ball Saga. That's right, I'm dumb. He doesn't even have, like, Dragon Ball Saga links either. That's unfortunate. Is what it is. I don't know if I'll, I'll easy A him. I've been thinking about it, and I just don't know if I will. Yeah, I already got the AGL Super Saiyan Gohan. I did that, like, the instant that it dropped. Will after the World Tournament unit. Don't plan to. Gotcha, Salvador. Yeah, that'd be a good one. That would be a good one. Uh, they refuse to make free-to-play units relevant anymore. Uh, yeah, for the most part. I didn't have any of the support units, but after a few multis, I managed to get 7 out of the 10. Just wait and hope for them to return so I can get the other 3. The other 3? What other 3 are they? I was about to say, have you checked to see if they're actually a part of the thing right here? Because right now, if you're missing any of these, I mean, they're all right here. All these guys are right here. You can get Turles, Bardock... The screaming freaking boo. Um, oh, you were talking about the sword support type units. My bad, my bad, my bad. Yeah, I don't know if any of them will return. I don't know if any of those support units will return. Uh, I don't even have the uh, I don't even have the medals to get them anymore. The dupes I have are the dupes I have. I don't know if these guys will come back. I really don't. Um, the, it's been two years, it's been two years since these guys released, the, since the last time we saw them, since the last time we saw them, um, I was really hoping when they were announced on JP for their easy A, that they would actually just say screw it and put them in, uh, the loot pool. I don't know why they didn't decide to put it into the summon pool, but they didn't. Very weird. Very funky. Very, very, very strange choice. Not sure why they did that. Yeah, they really should put them as unfeatured. They really should have. I don't. I really don't know why they don't. There's no reason not to either. It's not like they're exclusive or crossover or require some IP usage. It's just really weird. Yeah, it's either get them now or you might not have them. That's the really crappy thing about it. 
I mean, some of them are kind of bad. Some of them will get more use than others over the years. Um, they're not going to receive super easy A's, so they are as is. I will say that. Like, they're not going to get any better. The super easy A feature is only for Dokkan Fests and LRs. Um, so, I mean, these are not classified under Dokkan Fest. But maybe if we lucky, I mean, they put the freaking Dragon Ball Fusion units as unfeatured. I don't know why they couldn't put these ones. Makes no sense to me. Yeah, I'll probably try to keep pushing World Tournament a little bit on the side. Um, we'll see what happens. But yeah, I, th I think that's... We're, we're pretty much at the wrap-up point right now. I'm going to keep going until it hits 7. I said I, that's what I have on the title screen. 5 to 7 p.m. PT. So, we only got a couple more minutes of the stream right now. You don't have Gohan, Cell, and Rildo. The intelligence Gohan is good. I don't think he's mandatory, but he's very he is good. I will I will say that. He is good. That one's uh, definitely unfortunate that you couldn't get him. Cell He'll Cell will get some gameplay as soon as um the heck perfect Cell gets his super easy A, but then outside of that, I think that second form Cell is just kind of bad. Rildo Rildo's okay. I mean, he's obviously good on GT bosses, but that's literally his only home and his only use. Otherwise, Extreme AGL is just not a good guy. Uh, it's just not a good typing right now at all. I don't even know when the last time it was good, in all honesty. Boo is only relevant because of artificial life forms. I mean, yeah, that's true. And even then, it's still very... It's He's only continued to be relevant because Boo Tanks exists. It's just because of Boo Tanks. Primarily because of Boo Tanks. If Boo Tanks wasn't physical, um, that extreme Super Boo support would not even be good at all almost well heck I just died as soon as I hit 100 million points dang Scythe I'm sorry man that's unfortunate I wanted the Fizz Sword Gohan the most because his SSR is very clean that's fair that's fair and honestly I mean the Fizz Sword Gohan I think is a good nuking unit I'm sure some people probably disagree but I think he's a good nuker All right, we're heading to the end of the stream, so I'm going to change the music. Um, once again, the music at the beginning of the stream and now the ending of this stream are uh, from the Saiyan Enigma. You can find his profile in the description of the stream. I just wanted to throw in some music from a... A Dragon Ball-esque kind of music creator. Because why not? If you don't like Faulkner's score, you probably won't like the music. But I like the music a lot. But yeah, we are hitting towards the end of the stream, unfortunately. A couple more minutes. About six, seven, maybe. I'll may, I might go over a couple minutes, maybe at most. Because I did. Uh, it did take me like five minutes before I started. What am I fighting right now? I just hold on a sec. <laughs> what am I fighting right now? What the fun biscuits? Uh Alright. <laughs> oh okay. Uh Alright. This dude went in here with a full Cyberman team. This is someone's actual team. <laughs> This is someone's actual team. I thought it was my team for a second. Like, I thought the game glitched out like heck. <laughs> uh, alright. Well, his funeral. Bye. <laughs> Dang. Alright. There goes all the Cybermen. Um... For collection, I wanted them all, but it's whatever, I guess. I mean, yeah, it is what it is. A collection would be nice. I have 55% of them all, but I got them all before uh, they left two years plus ago. 
And it, it costed me a lot of stones to get them then, and it would still would now. It's just not worth the stonage. They picked a very poor time to release the EZA for those uh, type supporters. They picked a very poor time, and they should just throw them into the loot pool. They really should. They should just chuck them in there. No reason not to. I'm going to lower it a little bit because it is pretty loud, my bad. I forgot how loud the music was for that. But yeah, once again, what you're listening to right now is Saiyan Enigma's um, his own OST that he made for an Ultra Instinct Broly theme, which is crazy to me. I do not... Um, I do not support AI art, and that is the one thing I will say I don't like about his video, um, that he threw an AI piece of art onto there, but um, is what it is. I enjoy his music most of all. And his music he's been making for years, so. Like, who would have known they wouldn't, wouldn't ever return two years ago? Yeah, nobody would have, Bringer. Nobody would have known that they wouldn't have returned. For real. Nobody would have known that. Uh, this almost sounds like World of Warcraft. Does it? I don't play. I don't play World of Warcraft, although I have certain individuals that have wanted me to play. I'm, I'm not going to. But yeah, fascinating. I agree the support units should be in the general pool like the banner units. Yeah, I exactly. Um, they should be treated as banner units and just be put into the summon pool. There's no reason not to. I mean, even at this point, I'll be honest, I understand Heroes is a big thing. Like, it's a big celebration every year, and that they always have the unfeatured Heroes units in there. But I think some of those Heroes units are starting to get... I mean, they are old. Some of them are old enough that they should just be thrown into the normal loot pool. They really should. Because some of those Heroes units also are just so bad at this point that it, it doesn't matter if people get a copy or not. It, it just it doesn't matter. Some of them are just too old, and they just they did not age well. So, not to mention none of the Heroes units are getting super easy A's. Um, so, unless they do a specific kind of celebration thing where they're like, yeah, we are going to super easy A some of them. Um, unless they say they will, but otherwise they shouldn't be getting super easy A's either. Uh, or they should release the type banner that goes with the typing of the new unit. For example, when Fizz Topo comes out, they should also bring the Fizz type supporter. I love it. I love it. Yes, I 110% agree. 110% agree. That is fantastic. Yep, right there. Hire him, Bandai. Hire him, Okatsuki. This dude's got ideas. W idea. For real. Pay the man. <laughs> Pay the man for that idea right there. Pay the man. Jeez. Solve all of the issues right there. People can just casually go at it whenever they choose. God. We will spend money regardless. Bringer makes an excellent point, too. <laughs> Bringer makes an excellent point. We will be spending money <laughs> on this game. As if, you know... As if Dokkan hasn't literally made billions of dollars up to this point, you know? It's just funny to me. Like, like the, the game has made over a billion dollars at this point. What makes them think that we're not going to spend money, you know? There's a haunting melody that plays when you die in World of Warcraft, but you can res yourself. It sounded like that song. Gotcha. Nothing should be exclusive besides any crossover stuff. I feel that. I feel that. I'm still disappointed that we don't have a Raleigh back. Like, I don't know why a Raleigh is not back either. It's really unfortunate.
Okay. So I think I'm going to have to uh, probably call it right now. Um, probably going to just have to call it. We are pretty much at the end here. We are we are pretty much at the end. Um, I appreciate everybody showing up for the stream. It was a good stream. I feel like it was a good stream, or at least a decent one. So, hopefully everybody gets a good placement into their world tournaments. Hopefully. I hope everybody gets a good placement in the world tournament, or at least the placement they want to. I can't guarantee I'll be streaming again tomorrow. We'll see what happens. Um... Yeah, we'll, we'll see what I, I probably won't be, just to be honest. But I, I perhaps might try. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Um, but yeah, good luck, everybody. On to your the rest of your grind for World Tournament. Try not to lose your minds. Try not to lose your minds. I know it's really hard with World Tournaments. World Tournament kind of just zaps your brain cells if you have any left after you've lost sleep over it. So... But anyways, yeah, that's going to be it for the stream. I'm going to go ahead and uh, get saw, just get kind of get ready for the night to be over. So thank you, everybody, for joining the stream, and I hope you have a good day and a good night.